Okay, so I had a little bit of uh, issues with this. I couldn't get the displays to be stable. Um, some would initialize, some wouldn't. Some would update, some wouldn't. And eventually I went back to Paul Strumfogunt from the TNZ group and added 100 ohm resistors into the um, SPI lines and that seems to have stabilized it. But then I had another issue that um, the readings were jumping all over the place for the uh, parameters from the because I'm sending MIDI from this board to this Teensy from this Teensy and what I needed to do and I didn't realize is I needed to isolate it so I've put an opto isolator in you can see I've got some jumping on the mucks at the moment which I need to sort out but I'll fix that the displays are all stable and I can make adjustments so LFO rate there's the LFO flashing there's the LFO rate and the LED goes down and I can I think that's fast enough and filter cut off if I can remember where it is there it is filter cut off filter is EG depth key LFO depth and key track I think it's perfectly acceptable to show you the parameters EDSR you can do multiple ones they will update I've only got the pots working at the moment I haven't done the switches but uh, they're coming next get the idea now we can move all of them well, they're updating fast enough and that's basically over MIDI I'm just sending values 0 to 127 although the pots themselves have a, re a re resolution of 1023 um, 10 bits obviously I can only send I could send 10 bits over MIDI but it just seems messy for what it is so 127 is good enough not to 127 uh, bits is good enough for what I want it to do and there we go